Um, it's my second night here in Bangkok City. It's really a busy, bustling, and such an exotic city. It took me a day to get used to like this city lifestyle. It's just like so touristy and just like really exotic. So um, the first day, you know, I haven't been here for two years. I am Thai, but then I like grew up in America, and every time I come, I just stay at a hotel. And, um, I'm here in Sukhumvit area, and uh, like even though 250 baht for like a for a plate of rice is still cheap for tourists, but locals would not usually eat like a bowl of food for like 250 baht or something that's under 10 US dollars. But um, I mean, it's the price that locals would eat would be around like 50 baht for like food, 30 baht to 40 baht for like a, a like you know, a drink, boba or something like this. And what's so authentic is this bag like in Thailand that they make that you could just, they used to have those drinks that just in like those bag like without even cups like, yeah that's like you feel like you're, I don't know like if you grew like I haven't personally lived in Thailand or you know the lifestyle but I, I absorb culture and then like this is like you know the thing when you come here it's like you eat like authentic food in Thailand and you're just holding like Thai style drink and everything <laughs> and um, so I do not usually want to take tuk-tuks over taxi because taxis are more metered and sometimes uh, like tuk-tuk is like they tell you like a flat rate and then sometimes taxis you just it's like cheaper than what tuk-tuks tell you um and uh well first day uh my mother and i got like each like a new like bowl of noodle soups for like 40 baht each and then fresh coconuts were also 40 baht each and that was like under 5 USD for both of us that's like very like local and it's authentic and just as good but then like we had to share a table with like like people because they were really nice they're like oh yeah you know there's let's just sit and chat and stuff <laughs> and then so this young lady like sat next to us shared her story that she had two children and blind mother and she has to like send her money for like medical bills and everything and um raise her children and then that's when i realized like how like useful like money is like that like you know you spend like uselessly and everything so like my mother was nice and like treated her to like food that was like 40 baht that's like not even like um not even two usd dollars but it like meant a lot to her and like she works like 5 p.m to midnight shift and then that's like 10 us dollars per day for like working and every day so i went to like i opted for like food court food at the mall and just like looked around at like malls after malls and malls and everything and and i love stocking up on like really like that you would find in the u.s for like more pricier so stocking up on that is really nice like, i got like a bunch of these like this is like a compact powder and everything it's like anti acne i don't know if it's actually like you know does its job it's like i think it's korean product it's like 99 baht that's like that is not even um ten dollars it's like really cheap it's like three four dollars wait no it's cheaper than that <laughs> okay so i took the bts sky train to siam and then to another stop called sapan and then took a free shuttle here
checked into this hotel called like Chiang Mai Ducet Princess in Chiang Mai and supposedly it's like right where the night bazaar is like you just go down and that's like where the main weekend market and all the fun stuff happens here and um it's like one of the top like recommended hotel but it looks pretty simple to me so like nothing like fancy or anything you know but um i'm about to go and explore this city and let's see what's up <laughs> I just let go of the fishies here at this temple to make merit and the strange thing is there were big fishes that came up That's and yeah now we're gonna go in there and pray <laughs> Back in Bangkok for another six days after Chiang Mai, and I'm now at Mphot here to get lunch. Oh. 